Good morning, subscribers. This is Jerry Walker of Needing Clean Floors. Just wanted to make a uh, uh, video about a quick, giving you a quick reminder about making sure you're properly prepared for these jobs that you go out on. You know, I go out all the time, and I, I in the course of you know my normal daily activity, I you know I see others. Uh, participating in the floor care field and you know that everybody has you know different methods different types of equipment different ways to transport the equipment uh, things of that nature which is fine uh, but the main thing that that is uh, unanimously uh, unilateral is something that we should have be doing across the board is making sure that no one is going out on these job sites unprepared okay so in order to make sure that you have everything that you need on these jobs you most definitely need to understand that everything must be discussed up front and if so possible or you have any doubts make sure that you go and look at that job site uh, from from personal experience um, I have been able to give bids and quotes over the phone without going to see a lot of job sites, uh, mostly because, uh, uh, you know, in my van, I, I have most of the floor care equipment I need for mostly any job, uh, except for very large stripping and waxing. Okay. I don't total, uh, propane stripper on the van yeah but any smaller jobs you know whatever it is that's pretty much uh i would need i pretty much have it in my van and uh it's good to to stock and stockpile these certain types of uh uh supplies because when we get out and about and we we run the risk uh, two, three o'clock in the morning. There's no stores open. There's nothing nearby. Being able to have these supplies accessible is is very, very grave to uh, ensuring that we cre uh, create an environment that says something about our business. We are going to come out. We're going to take care of our, our jobs, and we're not going to be unprepared. We're going to get your 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 store, your restaurant your place of business uh, clean up to par in a reasonable amount of time. Some of these overnight jobs, mostly they want to make sure that they have their place up and running and everything is smooth sailing by when they come there in the morning. No one wants to hear that you have to come back. And they, that's a very, very, very important thing that we have to remember to make sure that if at all possible, if we're trying to push this one day turnaround, we're gonna go out and we're gonna take care of it and everything's gonna be done in this one day at this in this one uh <clears throat> visit. Let's make sure we don't have to come come back. Making sure that you know what was properly stripped or what was properly uh, uh what needed to be properly stripped or clean was done so right the first time where you do not have to come back. So if you have all of your supplies and you make sure that the work was double and triple check and sometimes quadruple check, sometimes you even have another set of eyes going over these types of situations to make sure that everything is in place, you won't have to come back. And we, we, we need to make sure that we focus on these types of things, all right? Thanks for viewing, people. I'm Jerry Walker, Needing Clean Floors. Have a great and blessed day.